Hi buddy, welcome back to Answers Q. In this video, we'll see about a free Python course that is offered by EC Council. So before we see that, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, kindly do that first. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon that appears after that. So you'll get a notification whenever we upload a video like this. And you can also join our Telegram channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook. I'll give you all those links in the description. Do check it out. And here's a small update regarding Coursera. So Coursera is a very good e-learning platform where you can get courses and certification programs from 275 plus leading universities and companies around the world, which includes Google, Meta, IBM, Microsoft, Stanford University, Duke University, HEC Paris, John Hopkins University. So a lot of top companies and universities around the world are offering online courses via this Coursera platform. So if you want to purchase any course in Coursera, instead of buying a single course, you can opt for Coursera Plus because this subscription will give you unlimited access to 7000 plus world class courses, hands on projects, job ready certification programs. And this will give you an edge over buying courses individually because uh, if you buy in courses individually, it will cost you more. So instead of that, you can opt for Coursera Plus. Check out the link in description for Coursera Plus and get it if you are interested in it. So now let's move on and see about the free course offered by EC Council to learn about Python programming language. So the title of this course is Python for Absolute Beginners. And this course is offered for absolutely free of cost by EC Council through their coded platform. You can see that here it is absolutely free of cost and this is a beginner level course. So even if you do not have any prior knowledge in programming, you can still enroll in this course and start learning Python programming. And you have around two hours of learning content for this course, which includes 23 premium lessons. And in, a, and in addition to the lessons, you have some quizzes and assessments as well. And after completing these things, you can also get your certificate of completion. You can see that here certificate of completion is also available for you. And this course rating is also pretty good. A lot of people say positive things about this course. So that's why I'm suggesting you, uh, if you're a beginner, you can try this course to learn about Python programming. You can definitely just make use of this course. So now let's move on and see what are the things which are going to be covered in this course. So this course will cover very basic things about Python programming language. Like you can even get to know how to install Python, how to run Python scripts in terminal. You'll learn about PyCharm integrated development environment setup. You learn about numbers, strings, Boolean operators, lists, dictionaries, variables, and a lot more things will be covered. You can see that here. And there is a final project as well. So this will give you more practical learning experience. And again, here they have also mentioned what you'll learn. So these are the things which we saw so this is same and here are the prerequisites so there is nothing much you just need a computer or a laptop with an access to an internet so that you can take this course so here you have three chapters for this course chapter one is introduction to python and setup where you have five videos and here you can see what are things which which are going to be covered in the first chapter so you'll get to learn about the installation and setup part you'll learn the difference between interpreted and compiled programming languages you learn to create and run your first Python uh, script and then you'll also learn to set up your PyCharm integrated development environment. So these are the topics which are going to be covered in the first chapter of this course and there is a quiz as well. So for every chapter there is a quiz. So this is the first chapter. Second chapter is programming basics. So here you learn numbers in Python, strings in Python, strings manipulation operators, lists, dictionaries in Python variables in Python. So these are the topics which are going to be covered in chapter two. You have seven video lessons and third chapter is where intermediate programming, oh sorry, intermediate programming concepts will be covered. So here you have 11 videos which will cover topics like Python inbuilt functions, defining functions in Python, adding arguments to a function, default arguments, keywords or uh, infinite arguments or uh, written values, if else statements, foreign while loops, importing modules in a Python script. So these are these are the topics which are going to be covered in chapter three and you have a final project as well. So the project will be building a calculator. So you will learn everything about Python and then you will use Python programming language to create a simple calculator. So that is going to be a final project for you in this course. So this will give you a uh, practical learning experience, a good practical learning experience. So you can just make use of it and you can also add this project in your portfolio as well. And again, you have a quiz for chapter three also. So these are the things which you are going to learn in this course in depth. So make use of it. And here they have given information about uh, the instructor. You can also go through it if you want. And the average course rating is 4.9. So this course is pretty good. So make use of it. 
if you want to learn about Python programming. So now let's see how to enroll in this course. But before that, I would like to give you more information about uh, Python courses. So if you want to learn Python programming for absolutely free, you can just make use of the free Python courses available on the internet. So for some courses, you can also get a certificate. You can see the entire list here. Crash course on Python offered by Google, introduction to Python offered by Analytics with you. So there are a lot of courses. I'll just leave the link to this page. Uh, you can just click on it and go to this page and get Python courses offered for free of cost by different e-learning platforms, universities and companies. So make use of it. So there are nine to 10 courses available for you. So if you are learning Python, these courses will be definitely useful for you. Make use of it. So now let's see how you can enroll in this Python for absolute beginners course offered by EC Council. So once you're on the course page, click on this get free access button that you see here at the right top and you will be directed to a page like this. So here we need account encoded platform because that is where EC Council is hosting all these free courses. So just give your basic details like your name, email, country and set a password for your account and agree to their terms and conditions. Click on get started and create your account and log into it. And once you are logged into your account, just come back to the course page and you can see here start learning for free button. So just a second. So once you're logged into your account, click on this start learning for free button and enroll in the course. So it's a very simple enrollment process. I hope you will not find any problems there. If you want to get more updates about online courses, do subscribe to Ansys Q and press the bell icon so that you'll get a notification whenever we upload a video like this. 